Even though the Denver Broncos are 1-3 after the first quarter of the season, they do have some bright spots. Probably the brightest spot and most unexpected is left tackle Garrett Bowles and the level he is playing at. Through these first four games, he has played at the highest level that has ever been seen in his career. Consistency has always been a concern with Bowles, and four games is nice, but can he do it for 12 more? Through four games, he has allowed a total of three pressures, which came one by one through the first three games. The most pleasing aspect in regards to his play is the lack of penalties with only two in the first four games. Only one of the penalties was accepted and the other was offsetting, so that is some good news. It's worth noting that he isn't just getting away with holding as some may suggest out there, and he really is just not holding. Whatever Mike Munchak and Chris Cooper did to get through to him is paying off early this season. They also coached a change to his blocking technique, and he relies on the trap technique, which he does extremely well. There are times in the running game where he could do to get better leverage for more push to help open lanes. He can also do a better job at times protecting the hole than he does, but he hasn't been a bad run blocker by any means. The improvements are there on tape, and they are obvious if you know what you're looking for. Denver decided not to pick up his fifth year option, and he is making them pay by playing at a near elite level. Because of his play over these first four games, Bulls wins the MVP award as the only consistently good piece on the offensive line. He also walks away with a grade of 94.5 in the first four games and is the only Bronco player in the 90s. Denver needs Bulls to keep up this level of play for the rest of the season and become reliable as a left tackle. If they want to keep him around, they may want to start working on an extension sooner rather than later and before he can really make them pay. For Mile High Huddle and Sports Illustrated, I'm Eric Trickle.